Namaste YouTube. Today we will talk about another JavaScript segment. And that will be another operator. And this time the operator will be assignment operator. So what is an assignment operator? Uh, X equals eight. So I just assigned eight as a value for X. So that is an operator there. Uh, for Y, I'm assigning value nine. So that is an operator. What is an addition assignment well this is an addition assignment now so all of a sudden instead of doing this well let me set them back okay x equals eight x equals nine and x equals x plus y so 18 right so x now equals 18, x is 18, y is 18. The same way, let's say x equals 8 again, uh, y is already, let's say y is already 9. All right, so that is addition assignment. Subtraction assignment is y minus equals x. So which is the same as y equals y minus x. Okay, so, yep, y equals what? Minus 8. Oh, oops. In the console, actually, that doesn't work. Okay, let me redo that again. Okay, so we are working in a console that is different. So, again, x equals 8, y equals 9. All right, so now y minus equals a. Hmm, okay, y minus equals x. So now y equals 1, x equals 8. All right, so what I did, y minus equals x means, now the new value of y is going to be, y minus x. Show that again. I don't know. It, I mean, I know that it's I don't have to. You guys are smart enough to figure this out. So y equals y minus x. Makes sense. So y value is 1, which is the same as what I did here. The same way you can do multiplication assignments. x equals 8 again y is already 9 okay no y equals 9 and i can do x star y x star equals y that means x the new value of x is going to be x multiplication y or x star star here stands for multiplication same way what i can do here is let me maybe now bring back the x value to 8 y is already 9 then I'll do y's new value is going to be this, right? So what the hell did I do? y equals y by x. That's what I did. Let me show that again. If what is the value of y? So I'm going to make y equal to 9 again. And if I do y by x, that is 1.125, right? That's what I did. And then you have remind, uh, reminder assignment, or it's also called modular assignment, y equals 9. Awesome. x already equals 8. And if I do x modular, modulo, our reminder y is awesome then which is the same as x equals x right well that is not a better example anyways let me take this uh, x equals 9 y equals maybe 2 and what i will do here is i will say y equals x right so that is what you have 
Now, what uh, exponential exponentiation assignment, that is x equals 2, y equals 3, x star star y equals y. What is it? The simple mathematics, which is the same as here, what I'm doing here is 2 raised to 2 raised to 2, that is 8. So just like, you know, you doing x uh, is equal to 2, uh, I'm sorry, x new value is 8. But if I have to, let me set that back to 2. And if I say star star x, okay, that doesn't work. So I will just do x equals x star star x star star y and then that is 8. So multiplying x three times. Um, then you have left shift assignment. Well, this is shifting the bits. Let's print out the value of x. x equals 8. Let me do y equals 9. So x equals 8, y equals 9. If I want to shift uh, the value of x, to all right four zero nine six wow let me do the otherwise if the value of x um y many times are the bits right if you know bitwise calculation uh well, i have never done that in my project so far but if at all you have to do is if you're dealing with ip addresses and stuff then you will know so this is, this was the left shift, this was the right shift. So that is what an assignment operator is. It assigns the values. No big deal, right? So thank you for tuning in. You have a great one.